Good morning, fifth grade scientists from Shakota Intermediate School. Today we are on week four, lesson one. And as you can see, I have my little helper here today. This is Tyson, our mini Snauzer, and probably even heard him barking in one of the other uh, videos. A car drove by and he was on guard, so you might have heard him growl a little. He has been helping me out. So today, we're going to be working with identifying ecosystems. And we're going to continue our review process by using IXL Science. That seems to be something that's easily accessible and achievable for you with our distance learning. And I certainly appreciate all of your hard work. I've been seeing great success for you not hearing about a lot of problems. So be sure to email me if you're having problems or you're getting stuck. Okay, so today let's jump right in to our ecosystems. To do that, we're gonna switch over to our IXL. I hope it's not switching with me. Let me get there. Now you can see it. Fifth grade IXL science and we're going down to level P ecosystems and today one identifying ecosystems. Now as this comes up you're going to notice that it gives you some keywords a tropical rainforest and it wants you to select the ecosystem that would be for a tropical rainforest. So we have to look at all of our choices. It has a year-round rain and warm temperature, soil that is poor in nutrients and has many different types of organisms. Or this ecosystem has a small amount of rain, dry, thin soil, many different types of organisms. And then our third choice, this ecosystem has a small amount of rain or snow, thin dry soil and long cold winters. We know tropical is going to be that year round rain and warm temperature. So we would just click on that box and submit our answer. I think you get the idea of how this works. You know, look for those keywords like this one's talking about a grassland. So obviously it's going to have a lot of grass growing there in that system so you would want to focus on that All right i'm going to let you continue with your journey this week we will have three lessons so be sure to watch for all of those to drop down for you good luck questions can be emailed to me at lsutley at shakota.k12.ok.us good luck guys